Steelers. During the UK UFL Final Four game in New Orleans, UK player Terrence Jones there colliding and knocking down a UFL cheerleader by accident, of course, during that game between the two teams. But tonight, Jones showed up at the cheerleader's practice with a gift. 11 and 11's Maggie Rupert was there and is live at the Louisville Cheering Dance Off on Shelbyville Road. Hello, Maggie. Doug, Melissa, it is safe to say Terrence Jones knows how to keep a promise. He showed up at a practice here tonight and promised uh, that he delivered those flowers to that cheerleader. The impact player for Kentucky. The final core, Louisville versus Kentucky. And during the game, there was the run-in heard around the state. And to Jones, let him too much. UK's Terrence Jones crashes into U of L cheerleader Jerrica Logue. He offered to buy her flowers, and tonight he did. Our cameras exclusively met up with Jones outside Louisville cheer and dance before the surprise. You did a good job. I did. Yeah. Those look real nice. With his assorted bouquet, Jones gets ready to deliver a promise he said he couldn't break. I had to get stitches during the game, and it being my fault, me telling her I was going to do it, I just had to keep to my word. The short walk inside Garner stares and a lot of attention, and then Jones and Jerrica meet once again. Okay, man, relax. How you doing? I brought you your flowers, like I said earlier. <laughs> All right, Terrence, so how did it go? I mean, it went well. I was nervous walking in here. I've never been in the chair practice, so. I mean, I was really surprised. I think it's really nice of him. I know he said he was going to do it, but I didn't actually think he would, so it was really nice. The night of the game, Jerrica says the hit happened so fast, she didn't even know she was hurt. I, like, sat up. I didn't even think ever, anything was wrong, and then my friend looked and saw that there was blood on my neck. Four stitches later, she was back in the game, cheering on the cards. But for tonight, the rivalry is benched, and a little love from a basketball star makes the wound all better. Now, Jessica is a senior, and that was her last basketball game cheering. And I asked her, Wonder, where's she going to put those flowers? And she said, on her dining room table. Reporting live, Maggie Rupert, 11 at 11. Still practicing tonight. We can see him in the